Hello everyone, welcome back to the Storm 33. This is Tatiana. I'm here with some channel messages, okay? So let's begin. This is titled Heart Bonds, okay? I, I got this like a couple weeks ago. Somebody said Heart Bond to me and I got a whole download on it. Okay, y'all remember I was telling y'all the spiritual meaning of all the diagnoses and stuff? Okay, well, I know what it means about heart bonds, okay, and acid reflux. So, I'm going to read it off to y'all first, and then we going to begin, okay, what it means. A heart bond, I don't really get heart bonds like that. I lose, I lose to, but not no more. A heart bond is a painful burning feeling in your chest or throat. It happens when stomach acid backs up into your esophagus, the tube that carries food from your mouth to your stomach. If you have heartburn more than twice a week, you may have GER, G-E-R-D, but you can have GER without having heartburn. Okay, y'all remember when I was telling you about how Mary, aka Gina, her name was changed in 2003 when she beheaded Shanice. Thank you. And yes. So, remember I told y'all how she would aspirate all of us? And you can tell who she likes and who she don't likes. Now, if she don't like you when she eats you, she is going to get a heart bun. Okay? And she's going to have to throw you back up. That's why some of us came back with the Atlanta boy killer, you know, my James or whatever, James or whatever. She didn't like none of us, so all of us came back, even when she was the freeway phantom. Well, she just didn't like me. She spit me out, but everybody else came back. Like, I mean, all the other girls, she liked them, but she didn't like me, okay? Now, okay, the spiritual meaning of a hard bun is where the emotion that's associated with a heartburn is depression and anxiety okay so that means i guess she didn't like us because we were giving her depression and anxiety okay what is a spiritual heartburn in his great wisdom the lord doesn't want our faith to depend on our feelings and yet, by God's grace and mercy, there are times when we feel the spiritual heartburn. Time, okay, yeah, I do feel a spiritual heartburn sometimes, okay? Some people say yes. Times when we take in the world and the Holy Spirit, which is Mary, a.k.a. Gina, inside us, applies it to our hearts and our hearts burns within us. Okay, what is a heartburn telling you? Acid reflux that causes heartburn may also indicate other hidden problems in your digestive system. See? If she eats us, that's going we going into her digestive system or whatever the hell. Okay? For example, you may have too much acid. Yeah, we got acid in our body. Yes. In your stomach, which can cause <laughs> I ain't gonna care. That's probably why that's probably why I do drink a lot of sodas because sodas got a lot of acid in it. And if you do get, you know, drink water. I drink water, too. Now, I don't drink pops like that, okay? I don't people judge me. But when you drink water, she can feel it, though. So, she can come for you. You know what I'm saying? That's awesome. I mean, look, I'm just giving you the facts, okay? For example, okay, which can cause complications like gastritis and stomach ulcers. Acid reflux may, may also aggravate your asthma or other chronic respiratory conditions. Who? One more time. What are the psychologist causes of heartburn, stress, and anxiety? Okay. And this is acid reflux. Acid reflux, also known as gastroparesis reflux, which is G-E-R, is the backward flow of stomach acid into the tube that connects your throat to your stomach, called the aspergus, that long thing, okay, if you took anatomy. During an episode of acid reflux, you might feel a burning sensation in your chest. She said, she just said yes. Even James, they say yes. Commonly called heartburn. Okay. Um. 
what causes it be. Some lifestyle issues that may cause jug include being overweight, overeating, having caffeine and alcohol, see, and eating chocolate and spicy food, see. There are several tests that can be done to see if you have jug. <laughs> no, this ain't funny, but it's funny though. But yes, y'all, y'all need to, you know, be like that. I mean, but I don't know about the overweight part because they like to keep overweight people and eat them. So I don't know about that part, but yes. I mean, how do you flush it out of your stomach? Drink dilated baking soda, also known as sodium, okay, or soda. I mean, or bicarbonate of soda, okay? Drink dilated lemon juice or apple cider vinegar. Drink a glass of milk. Well, y'all always eat spicy food. Y'all drink milk. Chew some gum. I love to do that. Enjoy ginger roots and soups, smoothies, or teas. And take ibo gas, okay? How long? Do drinking water helps? Creating the habit of of or avoiding carbonated beverages and drinking water instead of sparkling water can curb the symptoms of acid reflux. See, acid reflux causes a burning sensation in the throat and chest. She said she did drink some water for us to come out though because we were staying in this. We were staying in this, so it was giving her depression and anxiety and heartburns and stuff like that. Drinking water, low fat milk, and herbal teas may help manage it. Okay, and the spiritual meaning of acid reflux is, yes, I will. Um, spiritual indigestion is a concept that refers to taking credit for God's work, see, in one's lives. Yeah, that's why she came back for all of this in this life. Instead of giving God the glory, this can lead to a self-focused life. So, I guess she's just a God. She's, I'm hearing yes by God, which can be affected throughout one's life. Acid reflux, also known as gastrointestinal reflux disease, JUD, can have a close link to anxiety and stress. Some research suggests that stress and anxiety can make acid reflux symptoms worse. Anxiety and stress can contribute to acid reflux. Reflux, okay. Acid reflux can be stressful and cause anxiety. People with jud are most likely to experience depression and anxiety. Right, right. They want it thing happy. Depression, anxiety, and chronic stress can lead to jud. Oh yeah, foo foo. Some common, I mean, some common symptoms of jud include. A burning sensation in the chest, also known as heartburn. I did have one of those on the Golden Girls, but I just got done smoking weed. See, that's why I don't like smoking weed like that. Marijuana, because sometimes I feel this bubble in my body. Do anybody else feel like that? I heard yes from my girl. My home, my, which, you know, we both, you know, my girl, okay, that died with me. We were the only two, we were the only two girls that she got. The rest were boys. So, yeah, she said, yeah, she get it too. Heartburn that loosely occur after eating. I just try to lay down, you know what I'm saying? Or uh, I try to drink some water. I ain't gonna lie, I do probably drink some water too. I ain't gonna care. Um, heartburns that loosely occurs after eating and can be well said at night or while laying down. Backwash of food or sour liquid in the throat. Yeah, some of us did come back gay. For inner seagull, acid reflux is also a sign of experiencing difficulties in regards to digesting life. Our body letting us know that we are feeling uncomfortable with what we are seeing, feeling, hearing, and experiencing. We might feel irritated, frustrated, and out of control. We are resisting life in some way. See? What do they mean? I just told y'all. Emotionally, anxiety. What are the manifestations of acid reflux? A burning sensation in the chest, often called heartburn. Okay? What is spiritual indigestion, right, Creed? Instead of praising God for what he is doing in their lives, perhaps you take credit because of how you raised them. See? Mary slash Gina. This is spiritual indigestion. Okay, with Shanice Mickey. Mickey slash Shanice. Of how you raise them. This is spiritual indigestion and it will affect your whole life. Giving God the glory frees you from a self-focused life. 
begin practicing this roof. Okay, well that is the spiritual they would it the spiritual meanings of hard bones and acid reflux when it comes to Mary slash Gina, okay, when she eats people, okay? I do not know. It will come to us. Enjoy.